G'day everyone, welcome. My name's John and today we're going to shoot a video talking about our new range of portable solar panel kits, our lightweight Alvolta kits that we've just got in. So we're really excited about this range. We have the 220 that you can see there and also up the back we've got our new 440 that's come in as well. So today we really want to look at the performance of these panels and we're going to compare it to our tried and trusted 200 watt Alvolta solar panel kit. We've been selling this kit for years and years and years and it's proven itself time and again to be an absolute reliable top quality performer. So we'll be really interested today to get into the details of these new lightweight flexible kits that we've brought in and compare it really with what we know is a proven tested solar panel kit. Okay so one of the main reasons we've changed over to our new lightweight Alvolta solar panel kit instead of our traditional kit that served us very well for years and years and years is everybody wants lightweight these days. Weight in a caravan is a major issue for people and also just carrying around a solar panel. These guys here they're a 200 watt solar kit and they're about 15 kilos. These new 220s, so they're a more powerful unit and they weigh just over six kilos. So super lightweight and also just very compact as well. When you fold this up, it's about 50 mil thick. It's skinny as, so it's super easy to pull in and out of your caravan, not hard to carry around and very compact. It'll slide into a very small space compared to these, which are, you know, some people do find them quite heavy. So that's the main reason why we've gone to these guys is really just to try and help people with their weight issues in the caravan and being able to lift the panels around comfortably uh, when they're out camping. So we just want to talk a little bit about what you get when you get these solar panel kits, okay? So one of the major things that these have as a big advantage over a lot of the cheaper stuff that's on the market is it comes with actual decent quality cable. This is six millimeter square cable which is probably five times bigger than most solar panel kits come with. And it's a full 10 metre length as well. Comes with Anderson plugs, alligator clips. You get the whole works when you get it. Now, the kits themselves don't come with a regulator um, because you may already have a regulator in your van and you don't need that. So you can either buy it with or without a regulator. This is your little bag that you get for your cabling. So you can get all your cabling, your alligator clips, your Anderson plug connectors all store in here. And this is the bag you get for the solar panel kit. Okay, so it's actually really decent quality. It helps protect the solar panel as well from damage. And you can see by how skinny it is, you know, six kilos, very thin, easy, easy to get around. So super, super convenient setup from our Volta. Okay, so just a little um, bit about the details of what we're doing with our test today, just so we can make sure that the test is as fair and equal as possible and we don't sort of sway the results one way or another. Every system we've got here has got exactly the same battery. So we've got a 100 amp hour Invicta lithium battery. We all have a high quality Alvolta MPPC regulator. Uh, the 220 and the 200, you've just got 20 amp regulators but the 440 has got a 30 amp but they're all the same brand and we've got also the same cabling kit that comes with each kit that's a 10 meter lead and it's six mil square cable so it's a good um solid cable and we are running through that cable to give us an accurate um, assessment of what we're going to get out of each solar panel kit as possible so each system is set up exactly the same obviously same sun same day same time uh, so we should get as fair a result as possible out of this uh, test today. Alrighty, so we'll get into some of the data that we've got so far. So the, the solar panels have been going about 10 o'clock this morning. Um, the day is not fantastic though, but it's okay. Like it's late May, uh, so getting into winter, it's been a sort of a patchy cloudy day. So it hasn't been spectacular, but it's not raining or anything like that. So if we look here, this is our new lightweight 220 Alvolta kit. And this phone over here is the tried and tested 200. But just a couple of figures that I'll quickly run through. First one that I really want to point out is the voltage that the 220 uh, solar kit is putting out, sitting at 19.1 volts at the moment, compared to say a normal 12 volt solar panel, which is about 17.8. And that's what 
um, our 200s doing. So if you know anything about solar, high voltage is fantastic. Um, makes everything work more efficiently. Uh, cable sizing, everything just works better when you've got higher voltage. So that really high voltage is excellent from the new um, our Volta 220. Uh, the 220 at the moment is producing 157 watts and our tried and tested is 141. So we're getting an extra 16 watts of power into the unit. Um, we'll, we'll do some crunching of those numbers and compare them. I know they're not exactly the same size kit, but I think when you look at that, you'll see that watt for watt, uh, the 220 will actually be working better than the 200, which is really impressive. So that's what it's doing right at the moment. So, so far today, our new lightweight kit has put in 380 watt hours of power into that battery. Uh, compared to 337 uh, for the older model kit. Again, that's only, what's well, about 140 in the afternoon now, and that's only since 10 o'clock. And like I said, it hasn't been full sun at all today. We've had, we've had patchy clouds. So yeah, I'm really happy with the uh, performance of the 220. Um, it says here that we've had a maximum power of 177 watts going in from that kit compared to 155 from our older model 200. Like I said, I'm, I'm sure most of you will know the solar panels never really produce their full rated output. You just gotta have perfect conditions and that really just doesn't happen too often. So to get 177 out of a 220 watt kit nearly in winter, that's a really good result so far. So maybe we'll go over and check on what the 440's doing. Okay, so this is the 440 kit that we're gonna have a look at the data now. Um, the thing you should know about the 440 kit is there's a 24 volt arrangement. It's not a 12 volt solar panel kit. Um, these two panels are wired in series. The end two panels are wired in series and then they're paralleled in the middle. You can in theory have two separate leads coming out of each one to two separate battery banks if you want. But at the moment, we've just got it set up as normal, which is a 24 volt arrangement. So your voltage is much higher, but perfectly fine to charge a 12 volt battery as long as you've got a good quality MPPT regulator. Okay, it converts the power down to what the battery needs. So let's just have a look at a few of these figures. Voltage wise, we've got 37.9 volts coming out of the solar panel, which again, voltage, high voltage on solar or cabling is a must really. It's, it's so essential and helps out the system so much. We're producing 317 watts of power right at the moment, which is fantastic. And like I said, fantastic for this time of year. Uh, and we have produced 722 watt hours of power today into that battery. You know, saying maximum of charge of 352, but I think that was a little bit higher. So it can take a little while to update that information, but that is also running really well. Very, very happy with that performance from this solar kit. All right, so we've had a look at our new lightweight Alvolta portable solar panel kits that we've just got in. Look, I'll be honest with you and just keep this between you and me. I was a little skeptical when they said they were going to be lightweight. Um, my experience in the industry is generally when you try to compromise by making something lightweight, you're generally dropping the quality down a little bit. But I think you'll see by the results, this is not the case. Um, the results, I'm really surprised by them. I, I thought our old trusty one would, would take the cake today, but it didn't. Um, the new lightweight panel kits have actually won and won quite comfortably, in my opinion. And I, like I said, I was really surprised by that. So excellent result by these new lightweight Alvolta solar panel kits. And yeah, the ease and comfort with which you'll use them, they are absolute no brainer for anyone is going camping, you need a portable solar panel kit and the lightweight convenience of these kits, just amazing. I hope you liked this video today. If you liked it, please like it and subscribe and we'll see you in the next video.